Good morning and welcome to your daily operations weather briefing. Well, we're waking up to some patchy fog across the region this morning. We've got some fog that has settled in overnight uh, here at the Wallops region, and we are uh, currently seeing those visibilities down to about a quarter of a mile. But we will see some improvement in those visibilities over the course of the next hour or so, and that fog will give way to some mostly sunny skies as we go throughout the morning and especially into the afternoon today. Looking at our current surface analysis, you can see high pressure off to the west. We had that frontal boundary over our area late last week into the weekend. That has dissipated over the Carolinas uh, over the course of the last uh, day or so. So we aren't really seeing any major forcing uh, mechanisms providing us with a real high chance of showers and thunderstorms as we go through the day today and for tomorrow as well. So expect mostly sunny and pleasant conditions. We'll see those high temperatures uh, reaching the mid to upper 80s. So uh, for the uh, first to mid portion of August, we're going to see some pretty uh, nice conditions out here today. Currently out there, uh, just a uh, low deck of clouds at the 400 foot level with that uh, fog that has settled into the area. Currently as of 8 a.m. seeing a quarter mile visibility. Winds out of the south at 5 knots. Temperature at 75 degrees and our relative humidity at 100%. Let's take a look here at our radar this morning. You can see really nothing uh, in the area currently, and uh, we are expecting that to be the uh, story for out throughout most of the day today as well. Could see just a uh, slight chance of an afternoon shower or thunderstorm uh, that's going to be pretty widely scattered uh, throughout the Delmarva Peninsula today when they do develop. Only expect a couple of those showers and storms to uh, form today, and it does look like uh, that will. Be most likely in the northern to central portions of the Delmarva. So down here at Wallops, not looking at a very high chance at all of any shower or thunderstorm activity. I want to look at our visible, visible satellite imagery. You can see the low clouds and uh, fog showing up this morning on the visible satellite just along the coastal sections of the uh, Delmarva and mo mainly the southern and central portions as well. So as you work your way towards the uh, central portions of the Delmarva and also the northern portions of the Delmarva Peninsula up around Salisbury, uh, not seeing really that uh, issue with fog uh, that we are seeing down here at Wallops. Taking a look at our uh, model and what we can expect as we go throughout the day today, looking at uh, very limited chances of any showers or thunderstorms. You can see here at 12 o'clock really nothing supported by the model uh, indicating showers or thunderstorms in the area. But as we go into the uh, mid-afternoon hours, around 2 o'clock, you can see the model uh, pointing to maybe some convection popping around Salisbury. Uh, but as we look at the uh, progression of that, it mainly uh, keeps the shower and thunderstorm activity in the central and northern portions of the Delmarva. Uh, not really bringing much of a chance down here towards Wallops today. As we go into Tuesday, pretty much the same story, not looking at any uh, major forcing mechanisms across the area, and we will see uh, very little in the way of chances for showers and thunderstorms during the day on Tuesday. Now, as we go into Wednesday, we'll see a little bit more support in the upper levels of some energy that will be moving through. And as you can see during the afternoon, starting to see some showers and thunderstorms firing off to the north and west and potentially giving us a chance later in the evening for those showers and thunderstorms. So for the next 24 hours, not really looking at much in the way of hazardous weather. Again, just a very slight chance of some showers and thunderstorms uh, widely scattered across the Delmarva today, only looking at about a 10% chance here at Wallops between the hours of 1 and 4 p.m. this afternoon. And, uh, of course, we are seeing that uh, fog settling into the region uh, earlier this morning. And uh, so we are seeing those um, ceilings below 500 feet with the visibilities below a mile as well. Currently seeing the ceilings at 200 feet and the visibility at a quarter mile. That will continue over the course of the next hour or so and then give way to mostly sunny skies throughout most of the day today. High temperature expected right around 87 degrees with light southerly breezes overnight tonight. Partly cloudy skies could see some uh, patchy fog develop once again after midnight tonight. We'll see a low temperature of 73. And then your next couple of days here looking at very similar weather conditions tomorrow as what we'll see today. A high of 87 uh, expected just a slight chance of a pop-up shower or thunderstorm during the afternoon of Tuesday as well, looking at only about a 10% chance. 
Then for Tuesday night, partly cloudy and mild with a high of 75. And for Wednesday, a little bit better chance of some shower and thunderstorm activity during the afternoon and evening with a high of 87 degrees. Well, that'll wrap it up for our daily operations weather briefing. We'll be back again at 10 a.m. for a look at your extended forecast. Have a nice day.